Hey fab friends! I just got delivered some new products I want to talk to you about. They're called Carol Baker. And Carol Baker here in Ontario has, I don't know, something like 15 locations. They are a face spa and I know Alberta has a location as well at Sunridge Mall. So this is great um, for our friends in Ontario and Alberta. The rest of Canada, I believe you can order online, but the products are really nice. So these are developed in house. This is their spring collection. So the colors are um, really light and bright. Let's talk about my faves. So this is a lip, a lipstick that's quite cool. Um, I didn't know what it was when it first came. I thought it was like a USB key, <laughs> but you open it and then a mirror pops up and it's a lipstick. So I like that. It's really, really neutral. It's just like a hint of pink and a hint of shimmer. I'll do a little swatch for you. It's pretty much for anybody who just wants to add a little punch to their lip. You can put it over top of matte products. So barely pigmented, really just like a hint of sheen. So it's a nice alternative to just going uh, bare lipped. It's a nice alternative just to, um, you know, nothing <laughs> at all. So it's good. I like it. I would put it over top of things because I do like having color on my lips. So the next one is their lip gloss and this one is called Romance. So it's really pretty. It's It kind of reminds me of NARS's Orgasm Blush, that kind of like goldy, pinky, shimmery, really lovely color. I'll do a swatch for you. So I'm not a lover of the lip gloss in general. I find my hair gets stuck to them in the wind and it's windy here in Toronto and I just prefer a matte lip. but. I've been thinking about mixing up my game and I did wear this the other day over top of a more matte pink color and it looked really pretty and it felt really creamy, it smelled really nice, it kind of smells like vanilla, like a lovely vanilla. So that is how it looks, nice and shimmery. The next is their blush that I'm wearing now, which I really, really like. So again, I normally do not like a shimmer on my cheeks, I will wear a matte product on, on for blush and then add in the illumination myself. That was my cat making a cameo. But this one's super pretty. It's called Effervescence. And I'll open it up. He's saying hi. So it's a beautiful pink gold. You can see how shimmery it is. It's really lovely. I've been wearing it for a few days now. I think it's gorgeous. Um, it is a powder, obviously, so it kind of sits on top of your face and then just kind of like, you know, gradually works itself in. I think it's super pretty. So the next are some eyeshadows. This one is called Hydrangea, and it's a blue. Uh-huh, it's a blue, but it doesn't go on blue. It kind of goes on like a gray, a gray green with a bit of gold. It's really, it's really pretty. So I'll swatch that for you. Again, really lightly pigmented. I, I think this makeup line would be amazing for say tweens, people just getting into makeup whose parents don't want them to go overboard with, you know, heavily pigmented things or people who are a little bit makeup shy and, and again, don't want to be too bold with their colors. This kind of stuff is great. So as you can see, I did a couple swaps here. You can see it kind of shimmers gold. Very, very lightly pigmented, which is nice because you don't want a heavy blue. The next one is, it's a cool color. Um, I've been wearing it, it's called Tulip. So it kind of pulls orange. It's a nice alternative to just wearing a neutral eye. Um, no shimmer, which I love. I have very, very sensitive eyelids. And so anything with any sort of built-in shimmer or anything that's too heavily pigmented my eyes hate it and so these are really nice they're um, really soft texture and no shimmer so it's nice this is the third one it's called buttercup I'm wearing it now which I will hold it up for you it's a ooh, it's pulling white it isn't there we go it's more of a yellow And I've been wearing Max Orb for years. I really like that color again because it's not illuminated. It doesn't make my eyes rash up. And this is a great alternative to that. So I've been wearing it for a week, no rashes, and it's great. Again, super light pigment. So I would recommend this makeup line for younger kids, 
getting into the makeup game, ladies who don't love the look of makeup on their face but want a little extra something, or perhaps, um, you know, uh, ladies that are a little bit older and just want to wear a little hints of things but um, don't want to go too bold. Or people who don't have a lot of time, because you can just swap this on, a little bit of shimmer and you're good to go. So I think Carol Baker, it's great. Again, you can find it at Sunridge Mall in Alberta and probably 15 different locations here in Ontario, ranging from Toronto to Hamilton to Peterborough, all those type of places. And um, yeah, it, it's very unassuming because it is a line developed from a face spa. So not traditionally developed by, you know, an Estee Lauder or a L'Oreal or that sort of thing. But it's nice and I like it. So I hope you do too. Thanks for watching. Bye.